All right, what's going on, everybody? It's a Lorith game, but um, I'm not doing a Let's Play episode today. Today, we're going to show you how to cheese Gwyn. Yes, there is a way to cheese the final boss in Dark Souls, and I'm going to show you how. Basically, what you do is if you parry his first attack that he comes in and does, um, I still haven't gotten the entire lockdown parrying down. I mean, I've got it mostly, but if you can parry Gwen's first attack, you can essentially stun lock him the rest of the fight with our, with a um, one-handed R2 heavy overswing. If you do it like right before he attacks, instead of parrying, you can hit him with the old 300 dam or 350 somewhere around there, which is essentially like a chunk of the um, like one of the little red bricks off his health bar with each attack and he stun locks whenever you do that so like he staggers back but he doesn't like you know like stagger stagger but still you can stun lock go into oblivion and that's how the easy way to cheese him I died because I got too cocky and got really close and then he hit me with the old razzle dazzle before I could heal back up but I did get him down to really low life and I've been struggling on Gwen on New Game Plus. Yes, this is New Game Plus. Um, for the past few days. So now that I learned we can stun lock into Oblivion, I think we can do it this time. But um, I'm recording this Thursday morning, it's my last day of school and it's only a half day so I'll get to upload this at noon. But it is like 8 o'clock here, that's not nice. You should let me parry you. Yeah, there we go, there we go Black Knight, there we go. That's what you need to be doing is let me do that. Please hit me again. Please attack me again. Oh, caught me off guard. No, no, get out of here. Stop. I was going to do the well, what is it? But then I forgot. I don't think I have it on this playthrough. Like at all. Yes, yes I do. We're going to replace the beckon with it. No, we need to replace. We need to replace that one with what, what is it? Because whenever we flick down, my holding X, of course, which is weird, and whenever we flick down, it's just like square up, dog. Now, no, guys, this isn't a giant dad build, which it might as it might as well be, but. It's not a giant dad build, I promise. I'm working on a giant dad build, but it's not this one. Get out of here. Oh! Thank it. Thank it. That was a close call. I did not expect to be taking that sort of damage. Now one person that I haven't gotten the parrying down locked on is the Black Knight. I mean I can backstab him. Yeah. And then basically after that we pancake and then we pancake again. Except the other times he legitimately pancaked. Yeah, because the last few times I didn't miss. No I would pancake him. And so we're going into Gwen's fight with 17 SS. We got this. Now I'm going to show you guys how to get the stun lock rolling. And I'm about to risk losing a bunch of souls. Because I'm not going to I'm not gonna have to go over there to pick this up. Parry. Get him down. Back up. Hit him with the R2 somewhat. Hmm, he didn't do it that time. Let's see how he kind of just staggers back.
See, it's basically a whole cube as well. We did it. Yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. My heart is racing, guys. My heart is pumping right now. We just cheesed Gwyn. And how many souls did we get? I'm waiting to see. 140,000? That's two levels. That's about two levels. Alright, now we're going to get this trophy for linking that fire. Because the last time I walked out, so we got the Dark Lord. Oh my god, guys, I'm shaking. Literally. That took me so long, but I finally did it. We cheesed Gwyn, and now we can walk into New Game Plus 2. This is insane. But I had to do it with you guys, so um, thank you guys for watching this. If you enjoyed it, be sure to press the like button, and I'll see you guys later.